My name is Eric. I'm an engineer here at Phillips and Temero. I'm going to talk to you about silicone pad heaters. Silicone pad heaters are an efficient way to keep your vehicle fuel, fluids, and battery running at peak performance. They're an efficient heat source because the silicone pad is mounted onto the surface, allowing direct heat transfer. There are three different applications for silicone pad heaters. Fuel or fluid reservoirs, diesel fuel filters, and battery heaters. Each type of silicone pad comes in various configurations of size, shape, voltage, plug type, thermostats, and CSA, CE certifications to fit a wide variety of installation applications. Plug types come in different options. 120 volt two prong, 120 volt three prong, 240 volt three prong, CE7 for European applications, and blunt wire ends. Thermostats are available in two temperature settings, 200 degrees Fahrenheit, which is 93 Celsius, or 300 degrees Fahrenheit, which is 149 degrees Celsius. You can find a complete list of pad options at phillipsandtemro.com. Once you've defined what silicone pad is right for your application, the next step is proper installation. Properly installing the silicone pad heater will ensure efficient heat transfer, which in turn will save power and extend the life of your heater. The silicone pad battery heater helps maintain your battery's optimal temperature in cold weather. This maximizes the cold cranking amps of your battery and avoids discharge due to cold weather. The silicone pad material is resistant to battery acid and fits directly into the battery box or tray. There are different sizes of silicone battery pad heaters to go with multiple applications, including CSA and CE approved. Just match the size of your single or multiple batteries to the size of the silicone pad. For installation, remove the battery from your vehicle. Place the silicone pad in the battery tray with cord facing the grill or front of the vehicle. Set the battery on top of the silicone pad. Resecure the battery in place. Route the silicone pad power cord through the grill or in a convenient location under the hood. At the end of the day, just plug the silicone pad into the appropriate power source. Thank you for joining us today. Please watch for additional installation videos on how to keep your vehicle up and running during the cold weather season. And don't forget to visit our website at phillipsandtemro.com.